everyone. It snowed. It's terrible out here. Well, not terrible, terrible, but I made Chester this nice tent yesterday and then I beefed it up again with the tarp this morning because the snow had all landed on top and it was sagging down, just made out of electric fence posts and tied to the fence up here. But he thinks it's great because it's dry in there. Chester! Do you want some bottom? See if he can get turned around in there. So I might put another wrap on his leg. His knee is kind of swollen again. I'm not sure why that happens or what, but it's a little bit sore for him and very swollen. So I'll try some, draw it out again later with the wrap and see if I can get the swelling back down again. My horse is still the same. He's got weight on his foot now though. Um, I didn't end up changing the poultice. I left it with the Betadine and Epsom salt poultice because the boot was still really good and I actually don't know that it's not in the right place or whatever. So I'm just waiting. It's been 24 hours now. I'm hoping that by tomorrow morning the abscess will have broken out and things will start looking up. Regardless, I'm going to take it all off tomorrow morning and see what I can see or if anything has changed in there. Um, we've had a few calves. another one earlier. It seems like when the weather changes then of course everything decides to calve. The one with the prolapse, my Isabel cow, I put that back in last night and then again this morning so I'm hoping it stays in for a little while and hopefully she'll calve soon so I can stop doing that because it's getting old fast. Um, yesterday someone asked me how or if I sleep at all. Well, I don't go to bed until after 11 and I always get up at 4.30. And I guess my, my golden ticket to that is this. It's Life Vantage's Pro Tandem NRF2. It's um, all herbal. It's made of, of milk thistle, um, I forget, green tea, turmeric, Ashwanda and Barcopa, I think. I can't remember. I'll have to look later. But anyways, I take that every day, one pill a day, and it basically makes me feel like the Energizer Bunny, whereas before I was just running on fumes and always feeling burnt out. Both my daughter and I have really bad allergies and asthma and it's helped with that too, like kept our immune systems up and we I don't even remember ever being sick like for at least a, a year or two anyways. Um, so yeah, that's how I manage. I take that and I don't think I could function actually without it. If you're interested in that or want more information, just say in the comments more information or private message me and I'll be happy to help you um, in that regard. Here's Chester again. He's just finishing up his bottle. He's a bull calf and I would actually love to just keep him as a bull calf and put my star brand on him, but I don't think my husband will go for that. I think he's part Simmental, but he's just the sweetest little calf. 
Oh, he's actually a big calf. But anyways, yeah, as soon as I'm done with him, I am going to drive out and check the cow that just calved and make sure that her calf is okay and getting up and not too cold. And then check the rest of them and see how, how they're all doing. But anyways, I hope everyone's having a great day. Take care, stay warm. It's really muddy here now because the snow is wet and the wind is blowing. So maybe it'll all dry up by tonight. Who knows? Anyhow, take care.